What up, sis? It's your girl, Brianna and I read. I'm sorry, you gotta get the, you know, double chin angle. But I want you guys to focus on my hair. I feel like normally the way I got the camera, um, it's a little too far back. So, I wanna be like this today. So, um, I hope you don't mind. But as you can tell by the title, I'm going to be doing a braid out on this old wash and go. Now, the curls are still popping still defined they are feeling a little bit dry and i kind of been styling it did like two puffs yesterday i had like i was doing just a bunch of different things so you know it's just been manipulated too much and so it just needs to be restyled so i thought what better way than to do a braid out like this is my chance i haven't done a braid out in a while i've been trying to give um i've been trying to give wash and goes a fair chance so I've been trying out different wash and goes but wash and goes just really take too much time like I gotta wait for them to dry all day and night and uh, you know if it don't dry right then it don't come out right and I wasted my time so I'm just I'm not for wasting my time so I'm gonna be using the Shea Moisture Intensive Hydration Twist Defining Custard this is my actually this is actually my first time using it I bought this a while ago and never used it but um i wanted to use something that was like a butter consistency which this is so i was like how's my chance so i was going to wet my hair but i can't seem to find my spray bottle anywhere it just fucking disappeared great so i'm gonna do it on dry hair um and i think dry hair results come out better anyways so boom it's fine totally fine I'm going to try my best to, you know, make them all around the same size, but that never happens. This stuff smells so freaking bomb. If you have the Manuka Honey Shea Moisture line, you know if you know you fucking know if you don't know you might want to find out because the smell is amazing Finally done, so again, this was my first time using this, so not sure how it's gonna turn out, but I will let you guys know in the morning. Okay, it is the next morning. I will be going in with the Meal Organics Mint Almond Oil. It's very lightweight, smells good. One of my favorite oils, doesn't leave you know my hair feeling greasy. So I just put some on my hands, just a little bit. You don't need too much. And I just keep it on my hands while I'm taking out the braids. This is to reduce frizz and just, you know, 
add some extra protection and you know shine on there when you take the braids out um <laughs> i'm sorry that i look so fucking mad like i'm just not a morning person at all as you can see <laughs> so that's why i was like you know what i'm not even gonna talk i'm gonna just do a voiceover for this one if you guys don't know the proper way to take out twists or braids, I have a whole video on that. So I will put that link in the description box if you want to check that out. Because this is not, you know, really details on how I'm taking out the braids. I'm kind of just doing it. But, um, yeah, so I'm going to speed this up. So right now we got a lot of length, it's very stretched, but it's not enough volume for me. So I'm going in with my pick, you already know. Now I'm just shaking it out in the final stages pretty much done but um I just want to thank you guys so much for watching love you sis don't forget to subscribe and check out the description box